guys. I just wanted to jump in to let you guys know that I'm still getting back in the groove of things and I recorded this video with the camera turned the opposite way. So just be mindful of that. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I appreciate you guys. And yeah, I just want to let you guys know that the video, I had the camera turned the other way, but guess what? The footage is still good. So here you go. Hey guys, so today is wash day and I haven't done one of these videos in a long time. So I'm going to give you guys a quick wash day video and I hope you guys enjoy. So I'm going to start off with my shampoos. I'm going to be using the Head & Shoulders Royal Oils Moisture Boost Shampoo with Coconut Oil. And this is what it looks like. I like to use this shampoo first when I go in and wash my hair first because it's really good for your scalp and I do um, deal with dandruff and dry scalp and all that and this does the job. So I love this for my scalp. And then I follow up with this Design Essentials Natural Almond and Avocado and this is what it looks like. I know that they changed their packaging so just make sure when you're looking for this it's the Almond and Avocado line. And this is the shampoo. So I'm going to go in and wash my hair the second time with this shampoo because this brings the moisture, the balance back in my hair. It leaves my hair soft and it doesn't dry it out. So I'm about to wash and be back. Alright y'all, so I'm back, my hair is washed, and it is a tangly mess. Um, I'm about to part it into my sections, um, yeah, and get this deep conditioner in here. The deep conditioner that I'm using today is by Dr. Miracles. It's the Strong and Healthy Rice Protein and Babasu Oil. It's a hydrating and strengthening deep conditioner, and this is... Oh, where's the <laughs> here it is. This is what it looks like. It's the one in the green and tan container. I know they have um, a couple of different lines of this, but this is the one that I like to use. And I'm almost out, actually. So I'll be using this up today. I actually really, really like this deep conditioner. It has a really nice slip to it. It smells good and I can tell that it does make my hair a lot stronger. So y'all see what my hair looks like right now, right? So it looks kind of dry and it looks undefined and all that good stuff, but just wait till after I use this deep conditioner, you'll see. Okay guys, now that I have all of the deep conditioner in my hair, y'all already know I'm gonna take a plastic cap, um, put it on my head. Make sure everything is in there. So now, usually you guys know I let this sit in my hair. What I have been doing lately is I use a heat cap. So I am going to go pop this in the microwave and then put this on my head. I've been loving this cap and um, I'll put in the description box where I got the cap from. I can't think of the name of it right now. I think it's Hot Heads. Yes, I think it's Hot Heads. 
So I got this cap from Hot Heads. I love this thing. I use this thing every time I wash my hair and deep condition because the heat from it just, it just does something to all my deep conditioners and my hair loves it. And if once I pop this in the microwave, put this on my head, I can walk around the house and do something else for 30 minutes or an hour or whatever. So I'm going to go downstairs and pop this in the microwave. All right guys, now that I have my heat cap on, I'm gonna leave this on for 30 minutes and then I'll come back and wash it out. All right guys, 30 minutes are up, so let's see what we got cooking under here. So my hair is still warm, which is good. y'all see it's nice and lush and this is after 30 minutes it's back moisturized it's detangled all right so it's looking way better after the deep conditioner and like I said, get you a heat cap. Um, I'll leave a link in the description from where I got mine from. But yeah, it has totally made a difference in how I decondition my hair using the, the heat cap. And yes, I love that deep conditioner though by Dr. Miracle. It is really good and my hair is super detangled and back popping and moisturized so now I'm gonna go wash it out. <laughs> now I'm getting ready to blow dry um because I am gonna blow dry my hair today. I'm not doing a wash and go and I'm going to be using the Afro Sheen Freud Out Blow Out Spray. It protects the hair and controls frizz. So this is what I'm going to use before on my hair before I blow dry it. And this is, it has keratin aminos to control frizz, coconut oil to condition, castor oil to moisturize. And this is pretty much like a heat protectant and to help your hair be shiny. So again, this is by Afro Sheen. And yeah, I'm just about to blow dry my hair and get it dry.
All right, guys, so the last thing I'm going to do now that I have my hair blow dried is I'm going to um, put a little bit of this camera moisturizing oil. Um, it's a lightweight hydrating oil, and this is what it looks like. I am going to put a little bit of this on my ends because I am not going to flat iron my hair. I'm going to leave it blow dried. Um, and the reason why I'm leaving it blow dried is because I am working out and it doesn't make any sense for me to um, flat iron my hair because it's just going to get back frizzy while I'm working out and I'm not going anywhere. But this week that I need to have my hair flat iron. So I'm just putting this camera oil on my hair just to give it a little extra shine. And you don't need, need much at all. So I'm just doing a couple of drops. It's super lightweight, like you can barely see it on my hands. And I'm focusing mostly on my ends because you don't want them to be dry. All right. And for right now, that's it, you guys. This is how I blow dry, wash and blow dry my hair. Um, I'm probably about to put it in a bun. Like I said, I'm not gonna do anything else to it today. I'm about to put it in a bun. It's clean, it's moisturized, it's ready to go. All right guys, so I hope that you have found this helpful. Um, I will go ahead and list all the products that I use in the description bar, so make sure you check that out. Um, let me know if you've used any of the products and if you like them, and um, let me know if you're gonna be trying out any of the products. So yeah guys, Thank you for coming with me through my wash day and I will talk to y'all in the next video. Bye.